message of hope, a message that has the power to save your soul today. But we are so full of ourselves that we don't want to hear it. Sin has distorted our thinking. Sin has blinded us. And sin eventually will destroy us. Today we're here to preach life. Today we're preaching hope. Today we're preaching salvation in the person of Jesus. The Bible says whoever calls on the name of the Lord will be saved. Salvation is only found in Christ alone, my friend. Miami, every single one of us will give an account before God. When the Bible says that it's appointed for man or woman to die once, after death comes judgment. It's time for you to forsake your wicked ways. Judgment of God is coming upon the land, and you will stand before the Lord. You will give an account before God. Before when you die, you will stand in the presence of your Maker. The Bible says it's a fearful thing, a horrible thing, to be the, to, to die and, and to, the Lord to Jesus. be in the hands yeah. of an angry judge. Thank you, God Jesus. desires you to repent. The Bible says that God is slow to anger, not desiring not to perish, but all to come to repentance. Miami, it's time to wake up. What will you do when the party's over? The party will not last. There's no party in hell. It's a place of torment. It's a place of, a of, 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 of darkness. It's a place of separation from God, your Creator, for all eternity. You must repent. Repent of your sins. Forsake your wicked ways. The Bible says that we've all sinned and fallen short of God's glory. God's standard is perfection. And none of us can meet that. None of us can live up to that. Only Jesus Christ Himself. He was the only one worthy to die on the cross. He was the only one worthy to be the sacrifice for the world, for mankind. So that through His sacrifice, man can be reconciled back to his Creator. Today, the Bible says, there's a way that seems right to a man or a woman, but in the end, it leads to death. Life is only found in Jesus Christ. Apart from Christ, we are dead. Yeah, we are lost. Guys. We have no hope. We're hopeless. Jesus is the only hope, the hope of glory, our Savior, Amen. our Deliverer, our Healer, Amen. our Creator, our everything. Amen. Today is a day of salvation. Today, no drunkard will inherit the kingdom of God. No fornicator will inherit the kingdom of God. No liar will inherit the kingdom of God. No homosexual will inherit the kingdom of God. No, 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 no deceiver will, de will inherit the kingdom of God. Amen. Only those who are in the world of Jesus. Fire. The Bible says Jesus. the in the world are perishing. The lust of the eye, the lust of the Christ. flesh, the pride of life will fade away. But those that do the will of God will live forever. Amen. The party is over. The party is over. It's time for us to cry out to God. Time to the cry out. He gives grace to the humble. But, but he opposes the proud. The Bible says that pride cometh before fall. I need to get off too. What will you spend your eternity? Consider your eternity. You will not party for Why die in sin? Go ahead, go ahead. Go ahead, go ahead. Many people die every day. You believe, many of you may believe it's because of a disease. Why can't you examine yourselves and know it's based on your own actions? Your sin, sin leads to death. But God is so loving, He doesn't want you to end up in hell. For God so loved the world that He gave His only begotten Son. For God so loved the world that He gave His only begotten Son. That whosoever believeth in Him should not perish but have everlasting life. And then for the wages of sin is death. But the gift of God is eternal life through Jesus Christ our Lord. It's time to wake up, wake up, wake up, Miami. You need Jesus Christ in your life. This world is not going to last. One day this world is going to end. Even when, the, when earth and heaven end, God's word will remain. But there will be a new heaven and a new earth. Hallelujah. And that's coming very soon. If you put your trust in Christ, you will have a promised future, I promise you, if you come to Christ. Most people don't care about their addiction. They don't care about what they're going through. Why drink? Why get alcoholic? And not and abuse your own body? We're supposed to keep our temples clean. Our own body is like a temple. You may not understand that terminology, but it's biblical. No drunkard will inherit the kingdom. Jesus Christ is the only way, people. It's time to cry out, Miami. It's time to cry out to God. It's time to meet. One day you're going to meet your Maker. The time will come. 
Choose this day who you will serve. You can't serve two masters. The world, the world doesn't care about us. This world, it's full of deception. This world has so much wickedness. It's time to repent from it. But if you come to Christ, you shall be made new. All sins can be forgiven. The moment that Jesus Christ died on the cross, our sins were forgiven and we are redeemed by the blood of Jesus. Most of you are probably wondering like, wear a mask, wear a mask. You don't, you don't know what's for my own good. You don't care about me. You just want me to follow the world. You want me to follow those who don't really care about me. Why should I follow those who are against the Lord? I only am gonna I only need to follow Jesus Christ my Lord. I only pledge allegiance to the Lord my God, no one else. Only Jesus Christ is my master. Nobody else is my master. Only him. We are to only serve the Lord our God. Or actually, we are to serve the Lord our God, I meant. Only Him. And we are not to tempt the Lord our God. And also, man shall not live by bread alone, but by every word that proceedeth out of the mouth of God. That bread, that spiritual bread. When you read that word every day, you're taking that bread, you're eating that bread. That daily bread is the Bible. The Bible. The Word of God. What's the most, what's the best selling book in the world? The Bible. What's the most illegal, what's the most banned book in the world? The Bible. B I B L E. Basic instructions before leaving earth. Do you not want that promised future? It's so sad that people love their life so much. When you save your life, you're going to lose it. But if you lose it, you'll save it. Don't take the mark of the beast when it comes. When you take the mark of the beast, the mark in your right hand or in your forehead, Hallelujah. you're going to be taking it because of fear. But, I'm, but I need to let you know that when you take that mark, you are forever going to be doomed in the lake of fire. Don't take it. It's unforgivable. When you take the mark of the beast, it's unforgivable. It leads to hell on the lake of fire. I don't want that for you. I don't want that for you, Miami. Please come to the Lord your God, your creator, your maker. The one who loves you so much. The one who gave you life. The one who puts breath in your lungs. He gave you a purpose. Nobody else can give you a purpose but Him. You can have a true identity in Him. If you think, if many of you think this world's going to give you true identity, wrong. This world doesn't care. This world can just treat us like garbage and throw us out like nothing, as if we didn't exist at all. But God cares. He acknowledges our, he acknowledges our existence. He cares at least. He gives us a purpose. He's the reason why I'm still alive today. He's the reason why I'm not in hell. He's the reason why I'm not in the lake of fire. And He's the one that we are to worship. Every knee will bow and every tongue will confess that He is Lord. Believe it. Because one day you're going to stand before Him. Many may laugh, many may mock, but when you stand before Him, you will have no excuse. Neither will I. None of us will have an excuse. We came out here to preach the gospel to you because we care to tell you about Jesus Christ of Nazareth, who died on the cross for your sins, who was beaten he took a beating for many of us. He took a beating for all. If it weren't for Him, all of us would be in hell. We're all, yes, we're all deserving of hell. But Jesus Christ can save us. There's salvation in His name. When you come to Christ, you are forever sealed. Until the day of redemption. But those who leave Christ, they were never saved to begin with. Those who don't come back to Christ, they were never saved to begin with. But those who are backsliding and come back to Christ, they're still saved. Understand? Because time is running out, Miami. This world is crumbling. Every city will be destroyed one day. And once, the, and once all the mess, and then the mess will be cleaned up. A new earth. The millennial reign. 
There'll be a new earth, a new heaven, but there will be the millennial reign. The heavenly Jerusalem. The holy city. We can't be so casual about that, bro. That's eternity. eternity we gotta care place. about our eternity, people. That's the only way. Only Come way to heaven. Jesus. El Señor, el Señor Jesucristo es el único a el Padre. Él es el camino, el verdad y la vida. The way, the truth, and the life. El Señor Jesucristo, the Lord Jesus Christ. He's the only hope. No drunkard will inherit the kingdom. No blasphemer will inherit the kingdom. But if you repent, you can still go to heaven. There's still hope. Only Jesus can save you. We will never quit. Acts chapter 5, verse 29. It makes clear that we ought to obey God rather than men. We ought to obey God rather than this world. I'd rather obey God than a world that is so becoming evil. This world is becoming so evil. But Jesus Christ is good because He is the Lord our God. It's not too late to turn away from sin. You can change. You can be saved. You can become born again. To be born again. To have a new life in Christ. To have a transformed life in Christ. And very soon, I'm going to be heading to another state. So I might as well preach the gospel or let you know about Jesus while I'm still here. But Jesus Christ is coming soon. It's not too late. Jesus Christ loves you and He's not ready to give up on you. Please remember that, Miami. Praise Jesus. Jesus! It's not too late. Arrepiéntanse. El tiempo va a terminar un día. Hallelujah. That's right. That thing's loud, bro. That's right. That's right, bro. He came out like, whoa. He was wrong, bro. Hey, Jesus. Let's see how much time do we have? Oh, we still gonna hit a Google. We still got time, right? Yeah, sure. Let's hit a couple more spots.